All right, guys, I just, I wanted you to get a good eating video. So here you go, Chunker. Chunker. So these are my mint terribles. They are phyllobates. It is almost thought that, in my opinion, I think they can, uh, secrete a completely different type of toxin that is from stimuli that isn't their normal toxin that they would produce to cover their skin. Because mm -hmm. I've actually touched a tree bliss one time and it like numbed a portion of my finger. Has that ever happened mm -hmm. to you? It hadn't happened to me before, but it depends on your body chemistry though. Um, it's just like when they do secrete toxins in the wild from their diet, uh, it affects people very differently. Makes sense. And terribilis are the quote terrible dart frog. They are known as some of the most toxic or the most toxic dart frog in the world. Um, so even touching one of these, which I don't know why in the wild you'd want to pick one up, but somebody could, uh, you can actually absorb the toxins through your skin and it can kill a person. But luckily in captivity, we feed them a diet of fruit flies, vitamins, minerals. We don't feed them any of those toxins that they need to be able to sequester and secrete their own alkali toxins. So they're perfectly safe beyond, of course, the normal risks of amphibians and reptiles, which is salmonella and stuff like that.